Things are about to get good. The following contest is a two out of three falls match. Making his way to the ring from New York. Weighing in at 210 pounds. Guys, this match has the potential to completely change the WWE landscape. And it's because of this level of talent involved. He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. Here we go, guys. And his opponent from Oakland, California, weighing in at 243 pounds, Derek Marshall. Now this is a superstar who can breathe new life into this crowd. They were already alive, Cole. I don't know how this superstar is going to do anything to change that into being more alive. Yeah, Corey, but the fearless and daring behavior we see from this superstar brings the WWE Universe to an entirely new level. He said he'll be making a statement in this match tonight and will deliver it emphatically. Two out of three falls action set to begin here, where you have to beat your opponent not once, but twice. One of the most old school match types there is, and a true test of toughness. You think you're good? Winning this match proves it. Goodness gracious. You gotta wonder if there's more animosity in this match than we previously thought. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. No, 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 no. You gotta be kidding me! Oh my god, right over the top and hit hard. it off. Reversal! What a counter! And what need is there to go looking under the apron like this? If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. And some might say you have no margin for error in a two out of three falls match. Well, that's not true. You have a margin for one error, but if you aren't able to correct mistakes and adjust your strategy on the fly, that margin's gonna get thin very, very quickly. might not have a pleasant ending. Fighting free there, and that can be all the space that is needed. And now thrown back into the ring. He leaves the ring, and there's no countouts in this one. He'll take things into the ring. Sin. 
wrenches up the arm and a vicious kick to the jaw. I think rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind rage. Neckbreaker! You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. He's taking this to the floor now. And this one might be headed ringside. Heading back to the ring. Great strength being shown here. Stomach. My goodness, is this even legal? I don't think so. Oh, look at this ruthlessness in the bottom turnbuckle. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Taking a big risk here by bringing the table into the action. He climbs into the ring. Uh-oh, Forearm gonna cut off the win, guillotine applied. Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a round. And watch this, letting him free. Had him where he wanted him, but maybe he has something better planned. Denied with an elbow. Wind him up. Oh, and a four. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. What a springboard attack. Looks like he has something planned with his table, guys. I don't want to know. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Big boot. We are European uppercut. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Oh, man. Turns that into a devastating shot to the knee. Ripcord applied. Boom. Knock him down. Ouch. He's looking a little weary now. I think we're about to see a body go through a table real soon. This one is headed outside, guys. That table has only one destiny, and it involves being broken in half. Back into the ring. Oh, my goodness. That's it. Calling it by knockout. They're happy to win, but I think even happier to avoid going through a table. A tables match takes its toll, but they were able to pull out the win here. This victory is exactly the kind of statement I knew he wanted to make here. This was a message from him to the entire WWE Universe.